hello fam welcome back to our channel if this is the first time of seeing the channel please click hit on the uh, red subscribe button to get subscribe to this channel and the bell notification icon to get notified okay let's go straight to the news of the day hush puppy news is getting really messy and it's beginning to mention names and unfortunately it looks like uh politicians are uh, top-notch politicians may be going down with hush puppy if proper care is not taken it looks like the 2020 general is a very unique year covid 19 coming around picking some some top politicians now hush puppy is coming into play with fraud and mentioning things that efcc before now could not lay holds on as the national coalition of democrats ncd has called the federal bureau of investigation fbi and international police to investigate ex-vice president atiku abubakar and other stalwarts of the people's democratic party pdp over possible links to arrested suspected foster raymond igbolode popularly known as hush puppy Renowned for his flamboyant lifestyle, Hush Puppy and 12 others were nabbed in Dubai by Interpol on June 10 over multiple cyber crimes and money laundering to the tune of 168 billion naira. The Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, subsequently declared the Instagram celebrity wanted over links to several cyber frauds. In a statement signed by the spokesman, Garuba Nuhu on Wednesday, the National Coalition of Democrats reasoned that there could be more to this act, especially with Hush Puppy's known relationship with PDP members as seen in pictures and videos on social media. According to the group, Hush Puppy might have actually worked discreetly with the opposition party in laundering of funds for the prosecution of the 2019 general elections. NCD said its logic is born out of the fact that PDP's top shot, led by the presidential candidate, held several meetings in Dubai ahead of the polls and the likes of Atiku, Dino Malaye, Timmy Frank, Deji Adenyoju are possibly his close associates. The group therefore called on the FBI and Interpol to investigate Atiku and other PDP members who may have been first-line beneficiaries of the fraud committed by Hush Puppy. It added that Hush Puppy could have likely assisted these individuals to launder funds through his network because the level of fraternity between Hush Puppy and these individuals points to that direction. Now, the National Coalition of Democrats wishes to lend its voice to the recent arrest of Rush Raymond Igbenon, the popularly known as Hush Puppy, for allegedly hacking into the United States, U.S. and unemployed database and impersonating citizens qualified for unemployment funds of over a hundred million dollars meant for native americans in the battle against co coronavirus pandemic this is indeed a sad tale for nigeria in the sense that the arrest affected by the dubai police had indeed painted nigerians as fraudsters before the international community the national coalition of democrats has in times past alerted nigerians to the activities of some nigerians with no identifiable means of livelihood yet displaying a life of affluence in the social media space the case of hush puppy further lends credence to this concern raised earlier as most of our youth have elected to tour in a dishonorable path all in the quest to make money at all costs more worrisome is the latest development is the fact that the said hush puppy has been severally it identified with some members of the opposition party in Nigeria. This is also the heels is this is also on the heels that the top member of the opposition People's Democratic Party as PDP is known for traveling to United Arab Emirates where he had where he held several meetings in the build up to the 2019 general elections. It is also common knowledge that the PDP leadership turned Dubai into their strategic meeting place from where they plotted for the execution of general cup elections. The National Coalition of Democrats wishes to state in unequivocal terms that Hush Puppy indeed shares some affinity with some top members of the PDP as evident in the posting of pictures and videos of their several meetings in the social media space. It therefore reckons that there is every possibility that the said hush puppy might have been working discreetly with PDP stalwart in London of funds for the prosecution of the 2019 general elections. Therefore, the likes of Atiku Abubakar, Dino Malai, Timmy Frank, the Jadio, you have in numerous times posted and posed for photographs with the said hush puppy. It is common sense to articulate that there must have been in strategic business partnership with him in the area of repatriation of illicit funds for the prosecution of general elections using the syndicate 
network. The National Coalition of Democrats believes that the top guns for the PDP are first line beneficiaries of the fraud committed by the said hush puppy. There is every need for further investigation by the International Police and the Federal Bureau of Investigation. This is imperative in the bid to trace the roots of the heist committed by the by hush puppy as well as identifying his partners in crime in Nigeria. We are convinced beyond reasonable doubt that indeed hush puppy may have assisted these individuals to launder funds through his network because the level of fraternity between hush puppy and these individuals point to that direction. Okay, but generally, if you look at this, I guess um, this is uh, the ruling party, quote and unquote, trying to bring this to fall. When, when hush puppy was caught, a lot of persons started bringing out an old video, an old picture where hush puppy and Dino Malai, you know, stayed together, chatted together. Well, they are actually putting two and two together logically. Uh, hush puppy have not said, okay, that he actually laundered any money. This is just alleged based on what I'm seeing here, because as much as I know. They are just putting two and two together. Hush puppy could possibly want to be anybody's friend, and I'm not. Do, I'm not taking anything away from them because looking at the association with Dino Malai and the, why would they want to? But well, I wouldn't want to say our our politicians are men of easy virtue. But let's feel the pause of Nigerians over this matter because Nigerians are talking, and most of them are actually toeing in line with the fact that there is no smoke without fire. So if hush puppy are uh, uh, taking snapshots or having videos or uh, snapshots of top, top of some of these top politicians and the fact that um, Dubai was actually the place for strategic meetings truly during the 2019 election build up for PDP. There could be some element of truth in this but then it is not right. It is not true yet until it has been proven so. But let's feel the pulse of Nigerians over this very strong allegation. This one here is saying not far from the truth. This one here is saying oh, oh Diego this way i say it's very possible but does that mean hush puppy has no association from has no associate from the ruling party good question they should dig deeper and expose all of these business uh, business deals i have heard people pose positing that many politicians are first class yahoo men just very early earlier in early hours of today um uh, the likes of Omoyele Sowari said that actually hush puppy when it comes to the issue of crimes, issue of uh, scam, they're just a hush baby really. That we have hush papa and hush daddies who are our politicians. I didn't say so. Omoyele Sowari said so. But let's continue and uh, let's feel the pulse of Nigerians over this. This one here is a choice. When they win, don't blow fire and yash can open. Mm -hmm. This one here is saying, I have never seen this group advocate for good governance or democratic reforms in our nation. That's very very true this particular group all of a sudden they're coming up somewhere they, have, they always have a way of coming up i don't understand all of a sudden it's true it's a good question they just came up all of a sudden after this hush puppy thing and they started trending the dino malai picture between hush puppy and dino malai and it was not up to one week this group just formed and started giving strategic allegation Oh, well, uh, if it's true that the uh, the P PDP stalwarts are involved in um, uh, washing or legitimizing money or laundering money, then I'm afraid FBI, the international community, have no respect for such. So if they are indeed in partnership with him, they eventually will go down. Unfortunately, that's the beauty of the international community. How I wish our own community is like that. But then, let's feel the person. Let's still continue. Let's hear what Nigerians are saying here. This is to me, I trust no one, but I trust people by their word and body language. Everyone has his or her own case to answer. Okay, this one here is saying, this group are fools. I've never seen them advocate for good governance or condemn the insecurities in Nigeria. Mm. This one here is saying, this one here is saying clipping a froster from becoming a president is part of their mandate. Okay, this one here is saying, but I remember when the Jadeoju was calling for his investigation and arrest that he is a bad influence to the youth with no source of income. So why would he do that if they have something going between them? That's another good question. But then it's left for the Jadeoju to defend himself because this is a very strong allegation. Remind you, mind you, 
hush puppy have not mentioned their names these guys are putting two and two together and they actually want the radar of uh, uh, fbi to be on uh, the pdp uh, politicians but why are they only mentioning pdp are they saying that there's no politician also in the ruling party who also wanted or needed the services of hush puppy as in since they're mentioning politicians i didn't mention they did but then that's what we're going to round it up what's your take on this do you honestly think that there is a correlation between between Hush Poppy 2019 elections, Atiku Abubakar's strategic meeting in Dubai, and Dino Malai's uh, posing and relationship, and Bejadio's relationship with Hush Poppy. If there is, let's meet in our comment section. If there is not, let's meet in our comment section. What's your take on this? Don't forget to like, share, subscribe to our channel. Stay tuned for more.